Hello and welcome to my channel. Today we've got the 6 Ampere Milwaukee M12 Red Lithium Ion Battery. If we test this in the voltmeter we get about 10 volts. Which isn't very very bad. But it's not great either. Just in the charger we see we get the green and the red flashing light which uh, denotes that it's faulty. Demonstrate the nature of the problem. There's a little test you can carry out. To see which bank of cells is giving you the issue. 3.50 is the first bank. 3.50 is the second bank. And 2.87 is the third bank. So the third bank of cells is much lower. So massive cell imbalance within the pack. It's time to take a deeper dive into this battery to see what it's actually going on with. Right, with the bottom off the pack, I can see quite clearly that this is the problem bank of cells, these two. These two are the problem. So what I'm going to do, I could do a jump start method, which is boosting the whole pack. But I have another idea of how to get this up to voltage. Remedy the problem with this battery, what I'm going to do is use this XTAR VC4 Plus single cell charger in a very unusual way. I've done it before a couple of times on my channel. I've just taken wires through this little method to the edges of the cells and I'm going to charge them up to the same as the rest and hopefully that'll fix the pack. To better explain what I'm doing here, I've soldered on two bits of nickel strip on either side of this. I'm going to connect this charger. So I'm taking the power from the charger up to here as if it's a single cell. But I'll charge these two because it's still the same voltage. This is the positive side. And this is the negative side. I've connected this multimeter as well that's to monitor the voltage of the cells that we're bringing up and I want to bring them up to 3.5 they've already come up a little bit but they're coming up gradually so it's a, it's a waiting game until it gets to 3.5 yeah it's taking time it is coming up it just needs a bit more time right so finally we've got this bank of cells Reading 3.5, that's what we want. So we've got to stick this together and see what happens. So with that back together, we're reading 10.54 volts. So the only thing left to do is try it in the charger, it's just to see if it goes. This will take a little bit of time to see if the light stays red. So far so good. More time has passed now and we've got a green light so that would denote a fully charged battery. Taking it in the voltmeter, we've got 12.06 volts, so that's perfect. That took quite a while, but now we have a fully charged 6 ampere M12 lithium ion battery. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and check out my channel for all my other videos.